A common misconception about cholesterol might be putting children's health in jeopardy. As Gilma Avalos uh, reports tonight, even active kids who eat well could be at risk. The Rana family doesn't take health for granted. At only 30 years old, Prem had a near fatal heart attack. It was devastating. You don't think that it's going to come to you. Since her husband's big health scare, they've been keeping an eye on his cholesterol levels and on his. Because of dad's health history, Arnov's doctor suggested a cholesterol screening at age eight. His numbers were pretty skyrocketing. My first instinct was, now it's got to be uh, some error in the lab. Can we do it again? It was no mistake. According to the CDC, about one in 15 kids in the U.S. has high cholesterol. It's a huge number, which I think really is always surprising to people. The 10-year-old is very active. He swims and loves to ride his bike. It keeps me active. Also, uh, I can get out like of school a little earlier because uh, uh, they call bikers first. But this was in his genes. His father's heart attack was the result of clogged blood vessels due to high cholesterol. Arnav's grandmother also had a heart attack at a young age. This is a disease that starts in childhood and increases as you go through your teen years and then your young adulthood and often causes tragedy in people in their 30s and 40s. Dr. Blumenshine recommends every child with a family history be tested by eight and then again in high school. It can flag future health issues but is easy to miss. It's a sneak thief. It doesn't cause a child to have symptoms. For many children, obesity and diet are risk factors. But because Arnov's condition is inherited, diet and exercise isn't enough. He needs medication to manage his levels. And so does his dad. We thought the diet and lifestyle is going to replace the medication. That was the part we missed. This mom came so close to losing her husband, but thanks to the doctor who called in a simple test, they can manage their son's condition safely. We are living an example of what happens if you don't take care of it right away and what happens when you start taking care of it early on. Gilma Avalos, KDKA TV News. Mm,